हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल टेक्स पॉट दिस इज मी हरीश गोपाल सो बेसिकली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द लैचेस स्पेसिफिकली डी लैच आई फॉर टॉक अबाउट लैचेस सो इट्स काइंड ऑफ अ डिजिटल सर्किट और लॉजिकल सर्किट और आई कैन से बाई स्टेबल मल्टी वाइब्रेटर दैट मीन्स इट हैज हैविंग टू स्टेबल स्टेट्स जीरो एंड वन एंड इट कैन बी यूज टू स्टोर वन विट ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन now uh, in digital electronics we know that we are having four different types of um, latches that right? is sr latch d latch e latch and so but uh, here in this video we are going to discuss about the d latch now again d latch is categorized into two different types so that is positive level sensitive d latch and negative level sensitive d latch so we will discuss both the latches so let's move towards the screen uh, where first we will discuss about positive level sensitive d so in uh, positive level sensitive d latch uh, we are having uh, two inputs that is uh, d and enable as uh, latches are uh, level sensitive so we don't have any clock and one output that is q so if i talk about the functionality of d latch so when enable is high then only this latch will act as a transformer that means uh, the output q fo will follow the input d or i can say the latch will hold the current value of d okay and if enable is zero then this latch will um, latch will holds the uh, previous out okay so if i talk about truth table so truth table is like like enable is uh, when enable is high then only the um, output will hold the uh, current value of input that is d when enable is zero then uh, the output will hold the previous value and uh, this is the logical uh, diagram of this uh, positive sensitive d latch okay Now, if I talk about the waveform, so you can see the waveform. When enable is uh, low, uh, at that time output is uh, unknown. That means it has hold the previous value, and previous value may be unknown. Okay. When enable uh, goes high, then at that time you can see the input D is high, so output is high. At this point, uh, D input goes low, so you can see output is also goes low. At this point again, D input is goes high. When enable is uh, high, so output is also high. Now here enable is goes low, but output is high. Why? Because I told you when enable is low, uh, enable is low, then it holds the previous value. And previous value of Q was high only. So high you can see here. Now when again enable goes high, at that time D is also goes high, so output is also goes high. Okay. Now, uh, if I talk about uh, negative uh, level sensitive D latch, so it is also having uh, the same inputs that is D and uh, enable and one output. But the functionality functionality here uh, will change. Uh, the functionality is when enable is zero, then the latch is act as a transparent. That means the output Q will follow the input D. That means uh, the latch will hold the current value of D. It is reverse of positive level sensitive D latch. Okay. When enable is high, then it will uh, store or it will hold the previous uh, output. Okay. And if I talk about truth tables, you can see when enable is zero, at that time uh, the, the latch has holding the uh, current value of D. That is one. You can see output one zero zero. When uh, enable is high, that time latch is holding the previous value. Then uh, this is the logical uh, block diagram of the negative level sensitivity latch. and uh, this is the waveform so the waveform is reverse of positive level sensitive d latch wherein where uh, here when enable is high at that time you can see my output is unknown that means it has stored the previous value of um, q okay when enable is goes low here you can see the output at that time at this time my output is high so output is high when uh, d is um, when input d is goes low you can see output is also goes low when d input goes high again you can see output again goes high now this now at this point when enable is again high so uh, that q is output is holding the previous value and previous value is high okay now again here when uh, enable goes low at this time you can see my d input d is goes high so output is also high so this is about the negative level sensitivity latch so in this video we have discussed about positive level sensitivity latch and negative level sensitivity latch So if you are watching this video then please click on like button and if you are new to this YouTube channel then please subscribe to my YouTube channel thank you so much